direction. You know, I kind of I try to stay positioned, you know, right at the saddle. You know, I should be further back. Um, you know, on a shorter horse, I'd, I'd be tend to be further back. You know, these guys are a little bit taller, so I tend to stay more like right right at the saddle turn around so you can see this. softer. He's wanting to chew more. Boy. They're all different. It keeps moving every time. And I, I'm, my goal is to put my hand here. You know, and I'm not, I don't have to get there tonight. But you go to the exact same spot. <laughs> you know, um, you need to see how light I am on the pressure on the bed. You know, this is all new thing. figuring out they're chewing on it. The thing about these rubber snapples is you end up with all the teeth marks on it. <laughs> right. And then you, then you throw it away and get another one. But just getting them, you know, the, the idea of yielding to that. Now that he's focusing on this, he's actually gotten less reactive on his right side because he's got something else to think about. Even though he took longer to girth them, he hasn't had any, you know, humps in his back. Right. He's done really well. You know, but he had to back up and it you know, took him quite a while. But I, you know, I just kept pressure release, pressure release on that girth. You know, that's all I kept doing until he stopped and then it's when I did it tight. That's it. So I like how he kind of hopped his front end around. He's the type that he'll just think this saddle's an annoying fly, swish it off, kick it off, bite it off, you know. 
instead of just stand there and get over it, he's going to be like, yeah, you know, I'm done with that. <laughs> so that just means you have to do it eight million times more until it isn't a big deal. he's standing still, it's just not the look on his face is he's not like, doesn't have a hind foot resting, he's not licking and chewing you know, he's not totally with the program he's not fighting it, but he's not 100% You know, I've put boots on young horses before. You know, I like to put front and back boots on just to, you know, play dress up in case you got to wrap their legs. And young horses will rip Velcro quicker. You know, <laughs> any two-year-old can tear Velcro apart, <laughs> human or horse. <laughs> you know, and, uh, you know, they've got the Velcro boots on, and they'll just <laughs> have them off and play with them and chase them and stomp them. They took the bridle really well. You know, when you let it down, let it up real slowly so it doesn't bang his teeth. You know, they're all good about their ears and their head. That itching. Uh -oh. You had that little bobo on your face there. Yes, okay. There's your carrot man.